police stood guard as residents of Soshangove Township, north of the capital Pretoria, took to the streets Friday to protest against power cuts and water shortages. The demonstrators burned tires and filled roads with debris, paralyzing traffic. Our tapes has run dry. We are not bathing. We are not like the schools. Uh, every, every time the, the schools are going home, home early, they are, they, they, now there is a lack of education because of this water. There is no water in the schools or in the clinic. We are, we are being sent back when we are going to clinic. If you got something, there is no water. So this is a serious problem. Hence, we are doing this. It's not a, it's not a child's play. It's not. We are water is life, and we've got the right to have water. South Africa has been crippled by record power cuts since last year, plunging the country into darkness. As a result, many pump stations and water treatment centers have stopped working. Our fridges go down. We've got, we've got uh, insulin. We've got quite a few uh, products that are kept in fridges. You see, it has to be cooled. It has to be kept in a cool place. And with load shedding carrying on in this manner, we're losing a lot of stock as well. So it continues in this way. I don't see us surviving within the next two years. The country's water and sanitation ministry said it was working with water utilities to improve the situation. The problems have especially hit Johannesburg's Houteng province, but not exclusively. 